the decision 2016. Now, Senator Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton will face off in Milwaukee, Wisconsin tonight. The candidates are focusing on Nevada and South Carolina, where voters head to the polls later this month. Tonight's debate will be produced by PBS NewsHour. The next Democratic caucus is in Nevada, followed by South Carolina, and all eyes are already focused here for next Saturday's Republican primary. News 2's Ashley Yost is live in the mobile newsroom for us this morning. And Ashley, why is the South Carolina vote so important? Well, Octavia, it's the first primary where there's a diverse electorate, meaning we have a diverse range of minorities represented here in South Carolina. And experts say the black vote is key in determining who wins and Senator Bernie Sanders and former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton have been campaigning hard in the Palmetto State. This is a video of them at MLK Day at the Dome last month. The president of the Greenville NAACP says the group has been actively working to register people to vote so their voices are heard at the ballot box. It is so important that we're going to make the difference who win or lose in South Carolina, the black voters, and that's why we're working so hard to get black votes out. The latest NBC News Wall Street Journal poll has Hillary Clinton polling at 64 percent, Bernie Sanders at 27 percent. That poll was done in late January before the Iowa caucus and the New Hampshire primaries. Live right now in the News 2 mobile newsroom, I'm Ashley Yost, News 2. I'm as conservative as anyone in this field, but I'm the conservative that can win, the conservative that can unite the Republican Party, grow the conservative movement, and the one Hillary Clinton doesn't want to run. That's why she attacks me more than they attack any other Republican. So we're excited about South Carolina. Florida Senator Marco Rubio says he's feeling great about South Carolina. This is a video from Town Hall yesterday in Spartanburg, just before he went back to Washington, D.C. to vote on Senate business. The Republican field is smaller this morning. New Jersey Governor Chris Christie and former Hewlett Packard CEO Carly Fiorina announced they are dropping out Wednesday. You can keep up with the latest in De Decision 2016 around the clock on our website, counton2.com. Make sure you follow us on Twitter at WCBD and on Facebook and download our free app. Just search WCBD in your app store.